Hi everyone, it's Kira. Um, so to start, anything new, cool, or interesting about my past week? Actually, I got hired on at the gym that I lift at as a group fitness instructor for an F45 class, which is a functional 45 is what it stands for. It's like a high intensity class and like a group class. And so I've been training for that and I love it so much, but enough about that. Um, I chose to introduce the class to an American bison. The scientific name is actually bison bison, so it's kind of easy to remember. Um, I'm sure you all, hopefully, maybe, <laughs> have heard somewhat of uh, what an American bison is. Um, it's a large-headed brown-haired mammal, and it can weigh up to a ton. And they're commonly characterized by a hump over their front shoulders. And they also have hollow horns that curve outward and up from the sides of their head. And although they are massive, they're actually herbivores that eat leafy plants for 9 to 11 hours per day. Bison have an average lifespan of 15 years in the wild and typically they're found between the forests of Alaska and the grasslands of Mexico. And as for their ecological role, they graze grasses at various heights, which provides um, a nesting ground for birds. And they also enjoy to roll around in the um, ground <laughs> to pack down the soil into depressions that are known as wallows and the wallows fill up with rainwater and serve as breeding pools for amphibians. To reproduce, the males are quite aggressive and they attempt to dominate other male competitors by fighting for the female that they want to reproduce with. Um, there are a few fun facts that I find interesting. Bison are the largest mammal in North America and although they are very large, they actually run quicker than horses do. Um, and also baby bison are born with an orange reddish color and that stays for about a few months. And also to American Indians, the bison represents their spirit and reminds them of how their lives were once lived, which was free in harmony with nature. So that's about all I have for my bison presentation, and I'm looking forward to reviewing the species that you guys picked, and yeah.